Local growers are experiencing major consequences because of citrus greening. Yeah, typically their farm property is given an agriculture classification and comes with a significant tax reduction. Investigative reporter Darlene Jones learned now that some are actually losing that classification and it could potentially force them to sell their land. These are properties that we've owned for well over 100 years in our family. Scott Boyd is a former Orange County commissioner, but his roots are in the citrus business. The uh, property is uh, Valencia's and Naval's. But in recent years, like so many Florida growers, the family business has been fighting citrus greening, a disease leading to dead trees that aren't producing fruit, forcing growers to rip them out. So when the Orange County property appraiser staff assessed the property to determine if it was eligible for an agriculture classification, it was denied. This is one of the areas raising concern for the property appraiser. It's not hard to see if you take a look around both sides of me just how much open space exists between the citrus trees. We're just getting to the point where we can replant now. The Orange County property appraiser staff told us the office is bound by the law, stating only Florida farms used for bona fide agricultural activities can be taxed on the current use value versus its development value. Records show 190 property owners applied for an ag classification last year. Nearly half were denied for a variety of reasons. So we're looking at 30000 50000 a year. And now you pay what? About 500 a year. Judy Malanes has a 15-acre citrus farm in Windermere. Days after the family received this letter revoking their ag classification, they filed an appeal because that would force them to sell the groves as well as the family home. It forces my mother-in-law to have to make a decision about whether she can stay in her home that she's lived in for 40 years. Boyd fought and his classification has since been reinstated, but Judy's fight continues. They don't know anything about being a citrus farmer. And they don't understand the sacrifice. Darlene Jones, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.